Do you all recall the last time that we were in Japan? It was 2012, <laughs> and we won a championship. <laughs> Boom. Boom. And now we're back. <laughs> So we were in Japan for our U20 World Cup in 2012. I think the team was just really close. We had like so much fun all the time. Like we were always dancing and like making videos and being so weird. I mean, it was like a team full of studs, literally from like every position. I just remember being in camp and being like, wow, like everyone's so good. But then it was like so goofy. I looked forward to training, even if it was like double days. It's gonna be like, something's gonna be wild and fun. What do I love about Chris Everything. Well, I hear she's a great person. Like, honestly, her dance moves are just out of this world. Like, she can make any move, make it look so good. Oh, oh dear God. <laughs> My hair is so what? flat. Look, <laughs> why do I look uh, three years old? Why do I have such chubby cheeks? <laughs> it's really long. Wow, yeah, Sam, you got I'm not like mad about it. Did we like take these early in the morning? Like I, my eyes looked like shut. <laughs> oh gosh, man. Dear, oh dear. Well, keep those in the archives. <laughs> we got to go to five cities, yeah. right? Yeah. And I remember doing a couple of like events where we would go and visit a certain area and the people in Japan were obviously just so kind and gracious and, and things like, we like actually did a lot of stuff. journey in the tournament was not smooth sailing. You know, we were one, one, and one going out of the group stage, which I think we only really got through based on like goal differentials or something. Like basically it wasn't even a shoe in that we would go through with that record. So a lot of things I think had to happen for us even to go through, but from group stage, the team was even closer. You know, we um, leaned on each other for a lot of things. We, you know, felt that feeling of losing to Germany, but we knew if, in order to not feel that again, we have to like get it together and um, be unified. When we played Nigeria in the semifinal, I subbed in and basically like had a breakaway and like should have gone and dribbled and scored. But I got to be like 30 yards away from the goal and I was like, we're winning. I got to waste time and I veered off to the corner flag. Do you guys remember this? Because everybody, like everybody made fun of me. Like I remember somebody on Germany later made fun of me for doing this. <laughs> Can we just say this is how big of a team player Sam is? Instead of her getting her moment of glory, she said, oh, what does the team need for me right now? To waste time. Well, and therefore I'm gonna go into the corner flag. I'm pretty sure Steve ended up being like, you probably could have shot and scored and it would have been fine. <laughs> Cause it was like that obvious. Well, the one that I like for sure, like remember was the, to Kalia, the final. Yes. I was honestly on the right side of Chris. So like the second she got it, it was just like, like in the back, just like screaming. Like, Yay! <laughs> like, because it was yeah. just like, it almost felt like it was like a for sure thing but I remember Brie made a couple saves right at the end and one of them I remember she caught and then she there was like Smile. 30 seconds left and she went like this. <laughs> because we all like knew at that point like all she had to do was punt it out and we all started being like <gasps> and it was so cool. Everyone's like you could just see was like yeah. punt it but like all she had to do was just like just punt it like yeah. don't don't shake the punt do whatever yeah. and she like, nailed it it was awesome. <laughs> she nailed that game ending punt. <laughs> she sure did. <laughs> It's so cool that like the youth national team system is designed to hopefully like prepare you to maybe play on the senior team one day. And so to think that we had this U20 World Cup all this time ago and then us three are here now again and we've kind of been prepared for this in that way. I think it's like a, a testament to how great like the youth system is and the experiences it gives you. I think what's been really cool is that we were all able to share that moment um, eight years ago, nine years ago. And, you know, fast forward to where we are right now, we like can still reminisce on this, but also look forward to the memories that we are, fingers crossed, hopefully gonna create in, the, in this tournament. And I think it's also been great to just follow each other's careers and be a part of it as well, you know? Just like, we're all so different than we're, well, well, well Sam's still the same, but. <laughs> I'd like to believe that we are we are different people, but at the same time we have these shared memories, and it's it's really cool to be able to say, hey, we last time we were in Japan, we had this incredible memory, and we're we have another opportunity to create um, more memories together. So.